Hello learners and welcome to our channel PK Pharmacy. Today's video on medical coding questions and answers. If you are preparing for interview this video will help you. Don't try to skip and watch till the end. Today, we will be discussing some common questions related to medical coding and providing you with the answers you need. Question number 1 What is medical coding? Medical coding is the process of transformation of healthcare diagnosis, healthcare procedures and medical services and equipment into universal medical alphanumeric codes. Question number 2 Explain CPT. CPT current procedural terminology medical procedure performed in a physician's office are typically documented with CPT codes. CPT code is composed of 5 digits codes. It has 3 categories category I it contains 6 ranges which is most commonly used. These ranges are following evaluation and management anesthesia surgery radiology pathology laboratory category 2 it associated with performance measurement and some results from radiology or laboratory tests. An alphanumeric code of 5 digits is typically added at the end of 5 digit category ICPT code with a hyphen. The use of category 2 code is optional and not substituted for category I codes. Category 2 code reduce administrative burden by providing accurate information, especially on performance of health professional and health facility. Is category 3 in terms of emerging medical technologies, CPT codes fall into the third category. Question number 3 Explain HCPC. HCPC Healthcare Common Procedure Coding System, commonly referred as HICPICS. These based on CPT codes for medical procedure. The primary purpose of HCPCS codes is to provide information about item, procedures and services not covered by CPT codes. HCPC includes certain drug and medicines, medical equipment, prosthetics, ambulance trips etc. For outpatients HCPS official codes set for the services like Chemotherapy drugs Medi-Aid Medicare etc. These are most important code. These are two levels in HCPCS code. Level I similar to the CPT codes. Level 2 is divided into 17 sections. Question number 4 Explain ICD-10 coding. ICD-10 International Classification of Diseases, 10th Revision, Clinical Modification. A technical advisory board, physicians groups, clinical coders were involved in the development of ICD-10 CM. Today's, most third-party payers, Medicare include, require the use of ICD-10 CM codes to report diagnosis on insurance claim forms. Statistical death ration caused by certain infections diseases. The length of codes being a maximum of 7 characters, as opposed to 5 characters in ICD-9 CM codes in ICD-10 CM are alphanumeric and include all letters expect U. Question number 5 Phases of Medical Coding Abstraction Reading the Complete Record of Patient Assignment Find appropriate code for each procedure and enter into the system. Review assigned codes that clearly explains what happened to the patient. How were they treated? Question number 6 Competencies required to be a medical coder. Knowledge of medical terminology, anatomy and physiology. Knowledge of diseases, injuries and clinical procedures. Read and understand medical and surgical reports and patient charts. Attention to detail in multitasking. Well versed with classification and coding conventions. Computer and paper based data management system. Effective communication skills and high moral integrity. Stay focused and work independently. Question number 7 What are DRG? DRG Diagnostic Related Group. Classifies hospital cases into set group used to code only in patient claims. Many insurers pay only based on these codes. Every DRG has an attached payment weight. Factors affecting geographic location, cost of living, number of low income patients, if this particular case is costly etc. Question number 8 Define anatomy and physiology. Anatomy is the study of the structure of animals and plants. Physiology is the study of functions and activities of living organisms in their body parts including the physical and chemical processes in organisms. Question number 9 Enlist body system. Circulatory system. Respiratory system, skeletal system, muscular system, digestive system, excretory system, reproduction system, integumentary, skin, system, nervous system, endocrine system. Question number 10 Types of respiration. 
Respiration is the process in which organisms exchange gases between their body cells and the environment. There are three types of respiration. External respiration the process of breathing, inhalation and exhalation, also called ventilation. Internal respiration which is the diffusion of gases between body fluids, blood and interstitial fluid, and tissues. Cellular respiration the metabolic processes of converting the energy stored in biological molecules to usable energy in the form of ATP.